Hey, wannabe gamer here with another Top War Hero Spotlight. Today we're going to be talking about some of the strengths, weaknesses, uses, pairings of the newest addition to Top War, Panther Prince Fahed. But I don't know how long this guy will be with us because his panther doesn't look too happy with him, especially when he shoots the gun into the air. It looks like he's just going to turn around and eat the guy. But we'll go ahead and look at his bio and see that he was the largest merchant in the 90s. He's a weapons dealer, but he doesn't like dealing with the Dark Empire, so he decided to join the Freedom League. Now, his ability is broken up into two parts. The first part is at the beginning of the battle, it'll increase the health of all your units by 25.1%, but if you're on defense, it'll increase to 50.1%. Of course, these are at max stats. So definitely great for the survivability of your army. The second part of his ability is each time he attacks, he gains one anger, and at seven anger, he throws out three grenades to random targets, causing 135.6% damage. So he definitely hits very hard as well if you can draw out the fight, but it gets even better if the enemy stack that got hit with the grenade is below 50% what it started, it'll automatically crit. So if the enemy stack started with nine units, now it only has four, he'll automatically crit if he hits them with the grenade. Now going into some of his strengths, of course, since the HP boost he gives is doubled, while he's on defense, one of his best strengths, of course, is putting him on defense, either defending an objective or defending your base. And naturally, he's going to be good against air because you should be running him with army since half of his ability is based on army units attacking. Now, his weaknesses would be anybody with a higher high rate of fire than you or someone who can stop the fights quickly is definitely someone that Fahed won't get the most use out of since because if you can't draw out the fight, you can't make use of his ability of seven army units attacking. So the quicker the fight is over, the less damage he can do or the less helpful he can do, be for you overall. And going into his uses, like I said, since his strength is defense, he's great for a base defense. Uh, having the army defend your base is great because you can just have so many army units and his survivability is awesome so you can help whittle down your opponent's forces by just kind of the war of attrition by making the fight draw out as long as possible and that goes into who he pairs well with one of the first that i would like to mention would be bradley at max stats he's able to increase health by 47.5 percent so you put these guys together that's almost doubling the hp of your army just off their abilities not even considering their defense stats also, he pairs very well with Gira. Gira has a similar ability where when the units attack seven times, she's able to unleash a heavy hit. So if you can draw out the fight with both of these, you can hit very hard. Um, but also, she is able to reduce damage, uh, increase your reduced damage taken stat, so giving you extra survivability. So they both give survivability and benefit from a long, drawn-out fight. But some notable mentions that I'd like to bring up if you don't have those... Uh, other people that would be good to pair with him would be Bell. She also gets a, an increase when she's on defense that decreases the enemy's attack. So that's something to keep in mind. Also, if you don't have any orange heroes that you feel good with, uh, Rankenstein is a good pairing since he increases your army's dodge. Uh, gives you that survivability to hopefully make full use of Fahid's um, seven attack grenades, just drawing out the fight. Now... That's everything I have to say about him. I'm very excited to see what people do with him. Please let me know below what you are going to pair him with, what kind of abilities you're going to put on him. Let me know any other heroes that you would like to see videos on in the future. And please don't forget to like and subscribe. And have a fantastic day.